I was beyond confused. My brother Eric had me baffled again. His initial claim was straightforward enough. I was uncool. You're uncool. Maybe he was right. Firstly, I'm not too hot on your modern fancy damn gadgets. And secondly, my most reliable friends do indeed have busts for heads and are dead, in some cases, thousands of years. And the likes of Aristotle aren't too trendy, apparently. No, no, that's definitely not the Shady Queen of the 1984 novel. That's more like the Shady Queen of the 1981 novel. That Shady Queen is looking ahead, not to mention the fact that it's two and a half minutes late. So, if according to Eric, I'm not cool, and he so obviously is, I put it to him to fill me in on the big mystery. I wish I hadn't. Now listen up, Numpty. Discussing coolness in itself is pretty uncool, to be honest. Gadgets are important. You gotta know your gadgets. iPhones, iPads, Wii's. Now it's important not to be gadgety about them by obsessing on them all the time because then you're just a nerd. Don't be over familiar with them. Don't be under familiar with them either. What's more pathetic than a guy wrestling with his phone sending a text? Places to hang are integral. Don't go near the completely uncool spots. Unless, of course, these places become mobbed by really cool people and then it actually becomes cool to hang out in these uncool places. Do you get me? Same with clothes. Whatever you think is cool is guaranteed not to be cool. Dressing uncool can be cool because in other words, that's what's so cool. That you're being so uncool, you know? Nuts and Socrates had told me that true knowledge is knowing that you know nothing had I encountered such a conundrum. Could it be possible that I as well as every teacher from baby infants onwards have been wrong. Is Eric, in fact, some sort of riddle-spinning genius? Hey, get out of my garden, you mentalist. This is private property. Oh my goodness. I am so, so sorry. Of course, according to John Locke, all land is God-given and common, but you've obviously worked the land and built this fine abode. I'm sorry. You're right, T. This gentleman must be left to enjoy the fruits of his labor. This patch is indeed rightly his, and you have absolutely no right to be here. I know, I know, John. I wasn't watching where I was going. I was in such a tizzy over Eric. Rena? <coughs> There's a weird young fella talking to himself out here in the garden. <coughs> oh yeah, that's the cool thing now, is it? Did you hear that, John? Of course I did. Told you not to worry about. Give me some skin. Rena! <coughs> Am I cool? <coughs> oh. T, why do you still have this mug? Mom got that you when you were five. It's fine, look, it still works. Yes, I know it works, but it's not cool, man. And look at this hat, it's not. Damn it. The hat is not cool. No, no, sorry. I don't want to be cool. I want to stay warm. Yes. Cool hat. You do not look cool. Cool, cool, cool. cool. Uh, Moscow mid-February. That's pretty cool.